Some elders in Gombe State have rebuked Senator Danjima Goje over statements he made during a condolence visit to, at the weekend by wife of uh, Nigeria's President Aja Buhari and Governor Ibrahim Dankwambu to him over the death of his wife. The group led by Ambassador Abdumumini Abdullahi described Senator Goje's comments as uncharitable and full of deceit warning him against throwing Gumbi State into unnecessary political tension. TVC News' Larry Adeyemi has details. On Friday, 10th of November, wife of Nigeria's president, Aisha Buhari, and Gumbi State Governor, Ibrahim Dankwambo, made a condolence visit to Senator Danjuma Goje at his residence over the demise of his wife. During the interaction, Senator Goje accused Governor Dankwambo of ingratitude and insensitivity. This is Gombe State Governor along with his wife. Before, this used to be their house, but since he was sworn in at Pantami Stadium, he has not stepped into this house again. This did not go down well with some of the elders of the state. They have come out to rebuke Senator Goje, saying his claims are false. We would like to tender our unreserved apology to the wife of the President and her husband, His Excellency Muhammad Buhari, for this unfortunate embarrassment she encountered during her condolence visit to Gombe State. We would also like to commend the Gombe State Governor, Ibrahim Hassan Angombo, for the matured manner he handled the situation. The group also delved into Senator Goje's past actions to other notable national leaders. They demand that Senator Goje stops what they described as unhealthy antics. When the then CPC Buhari's presidential campaign tour were to visit Gombis, Senator Mohammed Danju Mogoje was then governor on the platform of the People's Democratic Party, PDP. He ordered hundreds of trips of Latra to block the runaway of Gombe International Airport to prevent Mohammed Buhari's plane from landing at Gombe Airport, under the guise that the airport was undergoing repairs. Senator Danjima Goje is one of the People's Democratic Party stalwarts that decamped in 2014 to the All Progressives Congress. It seems like the ground is set for a battle of supremacy between the two leading politicians leading to the 2019 general elections. Larry Adiemi, TVC News, Gombe.